Okay, I think I've worked out that in Malaysia you don't speak too quickly because suddenly we have a view. And this is where we're going. We're going down into the tea plantations down there, butterflies, vegetable farms. And uh, yeah, as you can see, before we even got a chance to have a look, it's um, the fog's coming in and totally taking away our magnificent view. But anyway, we're going to get it down in amongst it. So this is like the best moment of my entire life. I'm in a sea of tea. Now, most people come to Malaysia because it's got amazing beaches. Others come because it's got really cool towers like the Petronas Towers and the big center point thing that they've copied off Sydney. And a lot of other people like Craig come for the fake watches and other people, yeah, still come from fake, ha for fake handbags. But I, I come for the tea. And um, sadly though, in order for me to get into the sea of tea, because we've just come out of the rainforest, I have to, yeah. <laughs> Not only follow the goat track that got us here, but um, try and navigate this bridge that was he's actually built for like tiny little Indians. Anyway, I love you, Mum. Oh, yes. yes. And the best thing about this is the cracks must have come across after I've been broken. Oh, oh you fat lad. You fat lad. So we made it through the go track, which was down that mountain. Oh, it was kind of crazy without the uh, without the crazy view because it was kind of misty. But anyway, it's totally worth it because we are right in the middle of the sea of this. It's truly incredible. I mean, it's nuts. I mean, think of all these cups of tea, all the mornings, all the laughs, all the tears, all the seriously sweet, I don't think the divorce conversations that are going to take place over these cups of tea.